hi this is jay and i'm the sales manager over here at pinman so today i'm going to walk you through the features that pinman got so basically pinman is a marketplace where someone as a tutor can sign up and then student can meet a tutor and then purchase their courses or book classes with them then learn something from the platform so right in the home page we got the search functionality so that the students can search anything they want to and then here we got the categories so these are certain categories that admin has uploaded so then the user can get in and then find the tutors who are teaching in those categories and they can find these calendar slots of those uh, tutors and then they can do a class with them or you know find the relevant courses from that specific tutor and here we got the group classes and we got the courses as well and we got the verified tutors list over here for quick access and then we got the testimonials of the tutors plotted by student and parents and here we got the how it works page and we got the footer to update the website's terms and conditions and some of those contact information and here we got the multi-language so that the website can be translated to other languages and all the text will be translated so now i'm gonna log in as a student and show you how it works so right now from the dashboard we get quick access to certain menus and we got the upcoming appointments so if there is a session coming up right before 10 minutes here a camera icon will be showing up and the student can jump into the class and here the group classes will be showing up so then the student can check what's the upcoming appointment and then they can join the class and here we got the option to edit their personal profile and the student can check the you know uh, courses that they have completed and the certificates received along with them and here we got the favorite tutor list and we got the favorite group classes then the favorite courses and here for all the purchase courses will be showing up and along with the progress so then the student can check and learn from those courses and then here we got the transactions so for all the payments that's been made to the platform will be showing up with all the status say it's completed or you know refund or anything and if a student wants to request a refund, they can request it from this section. So if that's a one on one class, then the student has to request within three days of the class's time. And if that's of course, they can request within 30 days. And over here, we got the messaging section so that the student can initiate a conversation with the tutor. And here we got the notification center. So for all the notifications, regarding the payments or the class will be showing up over here and here we got the cart so then the student can add certain courses or class to the cart and then check out all together and now let me show you how the tutor end works So right in the dashboard we get quick access to the menus and then we got the profile over here so then the tutor can get into their profile and edit their personal details and they can add their educational and then other certification courses if they got and we got the option to set a price for the topics that they'll be teaching in the platform and just by you know listing the subjects you can find the topics and then they can set price for the top and here we got the group classes so all the group classes that the tutor has created will be showing up so then they can check and edit the details and if they want to add a new group class they can either create a free or a paid group class by entering those basic details and then they can select a slot from the calendar and then they can create a class for the same and here we got the availability to set one-on-one -on -one classes so this calendar is synced with the group classes as well so if a slot is booked there it'll be showing up say this slot is booked for group class so then the student tutor can create 
some other slot for the one-on-one -on -one class. And here we got the course manager. For all the courses that's been uploaded to the platform will be showing up. So then admin can check and edit the details. And if they want to add a new course, they can either create a free or a paid course by entering those basic details. And then they can create the course goals and lecture details. And if they want to provide a discount, they can create a coupon as well. And here we got the course transactions. So for the users or the students who have purchased the course will be showing up over here. And we got the upcoming appointments. So for all the students who have booked one-on-one -on -one class with this specific tutor will be showing up in this section. And right before 10 minutes, a camera icon will be showing up. So then the tutor can initiate the class with the students. And here we got group classes. So for all the group classes that you know the student has booked will be showing up. So then admin can check and get into the class. Here we got the coupons. So for all the created coupons will be showing up. And if the tutor wants to extend the expiry date or edit the coupon code, or even if they want to create a new coupon, can be done from here and they can select either a flat fee or a percentage discount and then they can set the coupon code and share it with the users and here we got the payment transactions so if a tutor wants to receive a payout they can set up either a bank account or their paypal id and using this the admin can you know uh, make a payout to the tutors and right in the payout section here the tutor can find all their earning status so for all the commission that the platform took and what they owe from the platform will be showing up in this section and then the tutor can request a payout from this section and if that's approved or rejected it will be showing up over here and here we got the messaging section so then if a student has texted you it will be showing up over here so then you can chat with the students and here we got the notification center so for all the new bookings and all the refund and everything will be showing up as a notification and if that's read the account will be updated in real time and now let me show you how the admin end works so over here we got the admin dashboard where admin can reach out to the quick stats of their website of the amount of tutor signed up and the students and then the amount of classes booked courses and everything over here and here the admin gets the whole list of tutors who have signed up to the platform and admin can get a detailed information if they have verified the email or if they have confirmed the zoom activation and if they are featured in the home page or not and if the account is set to approve or pending and right when they are signing up they would have to upload their personal documents like this the admin can check their documentation and then they can approve or reject a tutor's account so this is of the you know resume and this is of an id document to get verified and if they found them valid they can approve their account and here admin gets the list of students who have signed up to the platform and they can filter by name their address and even the status here we got the appointments so for all the appointments that's been taken through the platform will be showing up over here regardless of the class type maybe either for a group class or one-on-one -on -one, it will be showing up in this page so right before the session a camera icon will be showing up so then admin can check about that specific class and if so if they want to filter they can check it from here and here we got certain filters by grade so admin can create certain grades and the tutor can tag you know when they are scheduling a class and here we got the categories so then admin can create certain categories that will be taught in the platform and here we got the subjects so right in the category the admin can create certain subjects that will be taught in the platform and right within the subject it may be of the topics so it comes off a hierarchy say the category has to be created first and within category a subject has to be created and then goes the topic and over here we got the group classes 
and for all the crew classes that's been created in the platform will be showing up if admin wants to moderate the contents it can be done from this page and here we got the courses and for all the courses it's been plotted to the platform will be showing up so admin can moderate from here and here we got the coupons so admin can create certain coupons to provide some discount and it may be either for a class or a course it can be anything and admin can create it from this section it may be either of a percentage or of a flat fee and it can be created for a group class course one class or for all and then here we got the pages so pages are nothing but the static post that will be showing up in the folder of your website so if you want to update the website's terms, conditions, privacy policy and things can be done from this page. And if you want to create a new page, you can update the title and then you can upload the content here. And here we got payment information. So for all the refunds that the site owner has received will be showing up in this page. So then they can check for what's the reason that they have requested a refund and then they can approve or reject it. And here we got the transactions. So all the payments taken through the platform will be showing up over here. So then the admin can use this up for their banking and accounting purposes. And here we got the payout request. So when a tutor is requesting a payout to the site owner, it will be showing up over here. So then they can check uh, what's the amount that the tutor owes to the platform, deducting the platform commission and then they can approve or reject their request and they can make the payout out of the platform using these details and here we got the earning stats so as of the commission set here the platform will split all those payments of what the you know tutor has earned and what the admin has earned and everything and if the site owner wants to export this you can export this uh, either via CSV or PDF and then you can download it to their computer. Here we got the general settings to update the site branding elements and the product is a white label solution so all those branding elements can be updated right from this section and here comes the SEO so then the meta details can be updated from this page and if you want to add up some scripts it can be done from this section and here we got the option to update the images that's been showing up in the home page and in the other pages of the website and here we got the option to set up commission percentage so over here the site owner can set up the commission for 100 classes and group classes and right in this field the admin can set up the commission for courses and then they can decide the I mean, currency to be displayed in the platform. And here we got the SMTP. So SMTP is uh, the emailer. So if that's said, the platform will send automated emails and occasions. And here we got the email templates that I'll be explaining you soon. And here we got Stripe to accept the incoming payments. So it's already integrated. So you just have to create a you know a merchant account with them and can be configured over here to accept the payments and for the live classes we have integrated zoom and lesson space so you can decide to go either with zoom or less space and it can be configured over here and the classes will be happening within the platform and here we got the option to set the color scheme for your website so this is a hex code that you can search in google and update it over here and we got the other settings to update the key stats of your website and over here we got the email templates as i mentioned earlier if the smtp is set these emails will be sent out to the students and tutors on occasions like this and if you want to edit the email template it can be done from here and we got a crucial feature with the multi-language. So if you want to translate your website to any of those languages around the world, you can select the language and then update it. 
and this list will be showing up over here and you can check for all the words and then for each and every word that's you know in the website you can translate the word and update in this section and once you hit update this word will be updated and likewise you can translate all the words present in the platform and here we got the complaints so if a student is complaining you know uh, about any tutor or about any specific class it will be showing up so then the admin can take action on them Thank you.